What's up everybody? Welcome back to Hobokes TV. We're doing a little quick thing today. We're doing two things today. You're gonna see two things today. Uh, we got Rob coming over. He's bringing in the spine of his little 63 bug that he's putting together. Um, he's got the pans cut off. He's got all the suspension, everything, transmission. Everything's taken off. Uh, we're gonna weld in some new Wolfsburg West pans. Uh, I'm just gonna show you a super fast time, throw it in there, you know, cause everybody talks all kinds of crap about my welding, so. We're just gonna weld it in there, I don't care. <laughs> it's gonna look good, trust me, it's gonna look pretty good. Uh, so we're welding those pans on and then we gotta go to uh, in and out We got first Wednesday action. Uh, we're gonna see who shows up there, we're gonna see what's going on. And maybe, just maybe, we're gonna look at a, a special car that may or may not be there. Uh, we'll get a little better look at, at that one. Uh, you know, just a, a little quickie this week uh, as we're kind of between projects and working on like five different projects. We got a new motor, we got the old motor, we got a different motor, we got the yellow car, we got the gray car, we got the bus, you know, trying to get the bus back on the road. I've been having some kind of wiring and mechanical issues, little minor stuff I need to take care of, some leaks. Uh, so we're kind of in the middle of all that junk, so let's just do a little quickie. Uh, pans, in and out, first Wednesday, here we go. Let's go. putting uh, pans in Rob's pans. That was neat. That was from earlier. You weren't there. You didn't see that part? But we put pans in a uh, backbone in my driveway. It was, it was pretty cool, right? Yeah, okay. Well now, I know I told you this before and we didn't do it, but we're gonna do it now um, because we're here and it's here. So you guys know Chris, remember Chris? It's me again. Chris has a bus. But Chris has something cool too. I got a new toy again, because I can't help myself. Look at that. That is, uh, well, you tell us what that is. So this is a 57 oval rag top. Um, it is a respray of the original color. 
I have the birth certificate from the guy I purchased it from. It was here local in Austin. Um, yeah, it kind of fell in my lap. Um, how'd that happen? Well, the uh, wife-to-be, my fiance, <laughs> was looking for uh, <laughs> looking for wedding stuff on Facebook Marketplace and stumbled upon the post, for sale post for this thing, and looked at me and goes, didn't you always want an oval rag? I said, yes. She goes, I got something to send you. I told her, please don't. She did it anyway. So now we're spending wedding money on a, on a car, and I got future wife approval for it. Hey, that's pretty cool, man, because it's a, that's a dream car if I ever did see one. It was always my dream car. I, uh, I honestly never thought I was going to get to own one until I retired, but yet here I am. 57 oval rag on air ride. Oh, and, and does it go pretty good? Like, does it get down the road all right? It, uh, it definitely hauls, hauls the, uh, totes the mail because uh, it's got a 2276 that Doo -doo. is uh, very angry and wants to run. A 2276. Holy moly. Fastest bug I've ever driven or been in. Boy, that is uh, that's a nice looking motor too. Yeah, it's clean. It's uh, one of the cleaner ones that I've ever I've ever owned. Hey, look, it's straight axle dubs creeping. My car's over there somewhere. He always wants to be in the video, so he always finds a way to get in the background. All, all sneaky like. <laughs> You're our Easter egg. <laughs> There you go, and look at that inside. It's got the uh, the gauges down there for motor management. It's got that crazy tack thing going on. Ooh, I'm losing my mic. Got a got sound boom. system in it. It's got a nice little stereo, man. We heard you coming from. We heard you coming from like way over there. Oh, I, I was I was blaring Dwight Yoakam. It was yeah. great. Thanks to a really good friend of mine, I now have an air deflector, and I can't even express how much this helps. It's so much better, right? Um, used to doing 60, 65 going down the road, um, if it was a, even a remotely windy day, I would get all, all sorts of flutter from the headliner. Um, we just allegedly did 85 on the way here, and uh, no flutter at all. You went through Mexico to get here, right? Yes, that's yes. Where you were going. Uh, we took a detour through Mexico. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, yeah those uh, DCL wind deflectors, man. Our buddy makes those out in California. If you need one, I will put the link down there in the belows. Uh, he's selling out stock and making some new ones, so that's you know that's gonna do something. Yeah, you'll have to excuse the dirtiness. Uh, he doesn't know how to wash a car. We're just saying. We're just well, don't I've, let him even. I've speculate. never owned anything shiny. I, I shiny things scare me. Okay. Well, you should be terrified because this thing is actually pretty shiny. I don't even know how to wax it. I'm actually gonna have to get taught how to wax and take care of nice oh, paint because I've I'll, never owned. I'll nice teach paint. you. That'll be a good Saturday, huh? Yeah. It, cool. it needs it. It definitely needs it. Well, I'm gonna insert uh, race car video here because we did take it for a nice little spin around the block. Uh, the other weekend at my house and it was fast and we all got scared and then we had tacos uh, So there you go. We'll do a quick little walk around you can look in some stuff and then we'll go talk to Gary about his Sirocco addiction And there you go. Oh, what's that door on the curb? Yikes. Oh You want to hear it start? Yeah Oh, see, Gary ran away. I came over here and he ran off. Mid conversation. 
jerk. Uh-huh. All right, well, I don't know if that worked. It might not have worked, but uh, we'll see. Maybe I have to post it as a separate video, but that's cool. We can do that too. Oh, look. I don't think they even knew that they were at a meet. They just kind of came for a burger and then left. That car is the quietest it has ever been with that muscle. Oh, really? I want to hear it. Let's go start it up. Axel got a sweet new carbon fiber acropovic slip-on. Carbon fiber. Carbon fiber. The most expensive part on the whole car except for that shifter. And that shift knob. Holy cow. Now you got two carbon fibers. He's going to start this, so watch out. It's oh, right. so loud. Yeah, I like that. It's not going to be that loud. I'll just get Hey, that's actually kind of nice, right? It opens at high RPM. Yeah, it's got a small valve. The valve kind of opens up at high speed, but it's not. Will it slip on anymore? Or is that it? That's it. There's a little thing inside of it, but so you that's not the lowest point on the muffler. Whack that, on the car. whack that thing off and slide that thing up a little more. But you can always just jam that off, right, and be noisy? Yeah. Heck Good yeah. Time. That's cool, man. I dig it a lot. Yeah. That's cool. Look at that. And then we got we got old Crashy's ragtop. Is this the one that has the cool motor in it? Well, let's hope it's cool. Oh, look at that. It's got a decorative spring. Does this one have one? Oh! <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, it's a little 1776. You can't see it, but that's a, that's a Gene Berg motor. Built by Gene, right? Yeah. Not one of the knockoff Gene Berg parts motors, but a real Gene Berg touched it motor. I don't remember when you got this car. So nice. I was just gonna say I didn't want to be mean. <laughs> it was so nice. It was crazy nice. You got it out of Sedina? No, you mean I held it. This way. Martin sold it to the guy. No, that guy got rid of it on the bus. I don't know if you ever got one. I'm gonna replace the top. Chase, you're gonna have to do that. See how to do it. Sounds expensive. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, you told me they're about to five hundred bucks for the top. Yeah, and then you have to pay me another six or eight thousand dollars to do it. <laughs> I'm broken. I got to charge more money now. I got medical bills, man. Medical bills are cheap. You know, they're expensive. Yeah. I'm avoiding them so far. Yeah. <laughs> Push them back. I'll pay ten percent. There you go. So that's uh, that's Mark and Axel's ragtop car. You can see more of that on Straight Axle Dubs. Straight Axle Dubs. A lot of cool cars here tonight. All right, I think that's gonna wrap it up for this week. Hit the links, visit the friends, get the shirts, buy the parts. You just want, you, did you just want to be on camera? No. Oh. Well, you are now. <laughs> Dang so. it! No, he said you had info for a machine shop where you might know the number of the guy. I can get it for you. Give me a sec. All right, cool. I gotta wrap this up real All quick. Right. Uh, where was I? The Amazon store. It's not pointing that way. Uh, it'll work. Uh, yeah, the Amazon store, the the, uh, the links and all the good stuff. Hit the subscribe button. Comment down below. Watch my stuff. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next week. Uh, yeah.